Hey, I'm Zach, and we're learning Rodman by Mike. Um, this song is super pretty. It's one of my favorite guitar parts um, in a song I've heard in a while. Um, I tabbed the guitar part out, uh, the lead and the rhythm, and you can get that in a download link in the description of this video. Go download that so you can follow along with me. Um, first thing you need to know is the guitar part is tuned down a half step. So if your guitar is tuned E, A, D, G, you have to tune it to like E flat, A flat, D flat. Uh, so I'll play the picking guitar part first for you. Okay, so that's how the first part goes. And uh, the chords are C major, E minor, G major. Um, and basically you're gonna be just be playing power chords for the C and E minor. But what you'll do is leave the G string ringing open. So, so that's just picking it straight down, C, G, and G. Now the cool thing about that is you, those are the same notes, G and G, but it sounds different because they're on different strings. And that's what's cool about this guitar part is sometimes leaving that open G ring, it, the open G rings the whole time. But when you're starting to play uh, different chords, it kind of like certain notes are being repeated, but they sound different because they're on a different string. Uh, yeah, so the first part, C, and then slide up to E. So that's the seventh and ninth fret. And then G, and that's a G on the 10th fret and B on the 9th. And that part, you're gonna skip up to the B string. Okay. Okay. Um, and again, download those tabs because I think it would really help you if you see it tabbed out. Um, yeah, so that's the first part and uh, that's just the, the picking rhythm guitar part. And then there's a second part that's pretty simple, but these parts go together. Uh, the, first, the lead guitar part starts in the 12th fret. Okay, so uh, it starts in the 12th fret on the B string and then up to the high E string. And then that part is 15. Or you could play it like this and play it on the B string. But those notes are just uh, G, right out of the G major scale. So G, F sharp is the seventh, D is the fifth, and B is the third. So it goes. Okay, yeah, so those two guitar parts working together just sound super pretty. Um, yeah, and again, the tabs are available, so if you wanna you know, see it all tabbed out and everything, it'll definitely help if you follow along with this video. Uh, yeah, anyway, uh, this song's super great, and I hope you enjoyed learning how to play it. Thanks.